Today I will show you how you can georeference an image and then create a shape file in QGIS. So I have downloaded one of the image from Google. Now firstly, to bring that image in QGIS, go to raster and then georeferencer. Then here, just click on this icon, open raster. And as you will click on it, you can just click on your image. So this is the image that I had downloaded. Now I just want to georeference this image. And then create the shape file. So that I can get the boundary of this map. So for that what you can do is, first of all, over here you will see some of the points. We need the latitude and longitude of these points. Like suppose the first point is Fanda Kala. So I just need the latitude and longitude of this point. For that, I can simply search like this Fanda Kala Bhopal latitude and longitude and just copy this coordinates from here in my georeferencer. So I'll just copy this and paste it or you can even write it. So at times it's possible that you won't be able to paste it. So you can simply go to your georeferencer and write those points. Now just click on OK. This way you need to search many of the points so that you can get the accurate image in QGIS. And you can georeference this image in a very good way. Now I have added the second point. Same way like I'm searching and I'm finding the coordinates from Google. So you can use this method or you can use one more method which I'll be sharing in this video. So firstly, I'll just create some of the points and then show you. Now you can use this icon to again bring your plus icon. Same way, each and every time you'll have to add the points. Find the coordinates and then write the coordinates. So now here I have created six points. Now I'll just click on this play like icon which is start georeferencing. Then click on this OK. Then over here you'll select this as linear. And this will be nearest neighbor. Then after, as you can see, this is EPSG 4326. So we'll just change it here also. Then you can save this. And load it in QGIS when it is done. Then click on OK. Now again you will have to click on this icon. Then as you can see here you have got the image in QGIS. This can be made more accurate if you select more points. Like I had just selected 6 points so I got an image like this. If you give it more points for georeferencing then you will get it in the most accurate way possible. 
Now the next thing is how you can create a shape file of this. For that go to layer, then select this create layer and new shape file layer. Now give the file name of your choice. And in geometry type select it as polygon. Then after you will have to set the coordinates once that's done you can click on this pencil like icon and then click on this add polygon feature icon then after create a polygon like this While pre creating the polygon, you have to be very much accurate if you want the exact shape file of the image that you are georeferencing. So this is how you just have to left click and create the polygon. Then if I need, I can use this hand icon. And then please don't press any other key. Just press directly this add polygon feature icon again. Because if you will press any other key, then your whole work will be wasted. Because your polygon will get deleted. So as much as accurate you would be in creating this polygon, that much accurate shape file you will get so the shape file will depend on your accuracy now once this is done and you reach the final point then just right click now here it's done then you can place an id anything like one and click on this ok so as you can see over here we have got the shape file i'll just click on the zoom to layer and i'll just untick this bhopal zero referenced so as you can see we have got the shape file now this can be made much more accurate how we'll again go to the zero referencer window and before that go to your plugins manage and install plugins and install a plugin named quick map services here i have already installed it you'll get an option like install plugin just click on that and then close this window then after go to web then quick map services osm osm standard and before we start with this i'll just show you that you need to save your edits for that in the toolbar you can see the save layer edits click on that so that your shape file will get saved now i'll just untick this and again go to the zero referencer window if you have closed that window then the process is same that you will go to the raster and then over there click on the zero referencer now my window is already open so i'll just show you that here as you can see this as we had written the coordinates same way now we'll find this coordinates in the map like our first one is find a color so all you need to do is again create on this add point and then select this from map canvas so as you will select it you need to find your point in this map and over here once you find your point you'll just click on that point like here is my point i'll just click on that and you can see here you have got the coordinates and then just click on ok so likewise you will select many points 
so that you can exactly georeference your image. It's very much simple that just click on the point in the image, then click on the from map canvas over here, find your point and then just click on that point. So the coordinates will get added. The only thing is that you need to find your point in this map. Once you'll find it, you'll get much more accurate image. And then after you can easily create the shape file as I have already shown you. Thank you.